Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo, and I'm reviewing here Apple. Had two calls in this today, one for the options letter, which was a put, and one was a day trade. Really nice move in Apple. Had a lot of conviction in this today for lots and lots of reasons. One main thing is it rated the gap. According to the Golden Gap 26-point system, it rated 20 points, so it was a short. Also, last night, <coughs> excuse me, Apple had a very strange move on the earnings. First, it had a big move down, 162.55. It's there right now, actually. Then it had a big move up. Okay, this is last night. Post-market closed almost at 160, uh, 174 here. Big move up last night. Held it, closed the post-market. Then this morning, this is 4 a.m., by the way, <laughs> 172-ish, it literally collapsed, collapsed into the pre-market, collapsed on the day. So where did we open here? We ended up opening at 166, but this completely reversed itself, which is not normal. I mean, abnormal for a stock to do that so, so aggressively. Sometimes things gap and then change a little bit, you know, from where I rate it, but you could have literally rated this as a gap down, then rated it as a gap up, then rated it as a gap down this morning. It was just crazy town. So I really had a lot of conviction that this would sell off today. This chart has not been performing in the last month. Markets continued higher. Apple hasn't done it. Uh, and whatever was said on the earnings was not liked, and the stock really sold off. And it's lower right now, at least temporarily. Chart isn't an uptrend overall, but I'm telling you, this chart does not look that great, and I and I really haven't thought it's looked that great actually for the last two weeks. Uh, so it really needed to do something big to fix itself in the earnings. And and 174 where it was last night wasn't big to me anyway, so I wouldn't have called any longs in that at 174 this morning. But it didn't any open anywhere near there. So this is lower. Every trade in this work today, huge move for Apple and, you know, a great end to a very solid week and starting out February here, looking forward to seeing what the rest of earnings season brings. Apple did not do it on the earnings and we'll just see where it goes from here. Congratulations to everyone that did the day trade. If you're in the put, looks good here. Again, I thought this could drop all day, which it is. Uh, dream target today in a short in any direction for the day trade or the option is 160 and it's it's not crazy for the stock to get there today so good luck everyone and if you're interested in my method and learning how to trade gaps you can email me at melissa at the stock thanks everybody have a great day